Ryan Shimeni, software engineer at DeepGram. And today I'm going to be showing you what it looks like to use DeepGram with Amazon Connect. DeepGram offers an Amazon Connect integration in the form of some infrastructure that you can deploy in your AWS environment. That infrastructure allows you to transcribe your Connect calls in real time with DeepGram's best-in-class AI technology. Now let's take a look at how this integration works. First, a customer calls into your Amazon Connect call center. The customer enters a contact flow, which invokes a Lambda function, which makes a request to a Fargate task. The Fargate task pulls the call audio from Kinesis video streams and passes it along to DeepGram. DeepGram then transcribes the audio and sends the transcripts to a callback URL that you specify. The AWS resources pictured in this diagram can be spun up in 15 minutes by following the instructions linked in the video description. But what does it look like to use them? Let's hop over to AWS and see this integration in action. Okay, so now I'm in AWS console in CloudFormation, and I've spun up this DG Connect test stack. And this is the stack that's provided in the integration repo. It's called cloudformation.yaml. Uh, check the description to find that repo. And this has spun up a whole bunch of resources for the integration, but the one that matters to us is this KVS DG trigger. So this is the Lambda function that kicks off the integration, and we just want to note down the name of this. It's called DG Connect Test KVS DG Trigger. And that's important because we want to go into our Connect instances and we want to give our Connect instance access to that Lambda function. So we go into our instance, we go into Flows, and under Lambda we want to choose that function that we just spun up and we want to give our instance access, just like that. And so now it has access, which means we can go into the Connect dashboard and we can go into Flows. We can create a new flow and we can import sample contact flow.json. And this is the sample flow, again provided in that integration repo that I mentioned, which is linked in the description. And in this flow, we are now going to be able to go to this invoke trigger lambda and we're going to be able to connect it to this function uh, that we just spun up, DG Connect Test. So I'm going to save that. And we're also going to want to go into deep ground configuration and we're going to want to specify a callback where we can see uh, the transcripts coming in. So for that, I'm going to use this tool called vSceptor and this is just a tool that allows you to specify an endpoint where you can see post requests coming in. So I'm going to create a new endpoint called, let's say, connect test 4. And I'm going to copy the URL it gives me. And I'm going to paste it in under DG callbacks, save. And then I'm going to save and publish this contact flow. And then I'm going to go down to phone numbers. And I'm going to select one of the phone numbers and I'm going to associate it with this new flow that we've just created, this sample deep ground flow, and I'm going to save. So now when I call this phone number, it should invoke the sample deep ground flow, which should push transcripts to this Bceptor endpoint I've created. So let's test it end to end. Let's call that phone number. This call demonstrates real-time transcription with DeepGram. Okay, so now I've called it. Lambda function invoked successfully. And let's see if it's getting the transcripts. Okay, so you see this. Okay, so now I've called it, which is exactly what I said. And then you can see the next thing I said. And if you play back the video and you watch it closely, you can see just how real-time this is. And there's, there's that transcript as well. So uh, the point here is that these transcripts come in really quickly, um, and they're quick enough for a kind of voice bot use case or an agent assist use case or whatever you would want to do with real-time transcripts. So that concludes the demo. And thank you for watching. And I'm excited to see what you all build with this.